Hello, good morning from Rishi Cash. My name is Ivana and today I'm going to attempt to go to Delhi by bus. <laughs> I haven't booked a bus. I have to go to the to the bus station and see which bus is going to Delhi. And I actually really, really don't like that. But maybe I'm just being very, very negative and things will be perfect actually. So let's see. Indian shared directions. There's always space for one more. <laughs> Apparently this bus leaves at 7, it is now 7, so probably 7.30 or something and your girl is gonna take it and I'm not gonna take the luxury Volvo with the AC because I don't like AC anyway, it's so cold And then there is a little piggy running <laughs> at the bus stand, getting chased away by dogs <laughs> While this is happening, your girl is taking the local bus <laughs> Lily, here we go I have no idea what time will arrive but Maybe it's going to be an awesome journey. Winning a motherfucking life. They even have power outlets in the bus. So this trip is going to take all day because this traffic is nuts. Also, unfortunately, this bus has air conditioning. I hate air conditioning, man. It's always set on freaking frostbites. Wow, it's so cold. Traffic cleared up. Uh, we drove quite a lot. I have no idea where we are right now, but but we have stopped for food. Nom 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 nom. I am going to have a tali. Winning a life. I've never tried paneer bread pakoda before, so I thought it was just a sandwich with paneer. But it's like I don't know. It looks delicious. Thank you. I also got one for takeaway because I just was so hungry in the bus and I was like I don't know when we're going to stop for food and I don't want that situation anymore so I got one for takeaway I'm gonna dip it I'm gonna eat with my hands because it's way more fun Are you good? I like it mm. So if I have to describe it I would say it's like grilled cheese with paneer and then battered and deep fried again yeah. Good. Mm. Yep. Thank you. <laughs> Tali. Mm. Can you hear that song? Can you hear that song? Mm. One of the things I'm most looking forward to when getting to Delhi, I'm so going to watch. I I Dil Hey Mushka. I think that's what it's called. I have the there's like a YouTube jukebox playlist. And I've been playing it on repeat. I love the music of the of the movie. Mm. So this is the Punjabi Dali. We have chana masala, aloo sabji, raita, and some naan rotis. Oh, I never know the difference between naan and rotis. I'm sorry. Not even after all of this time. But. I think it's very cute how people keep telling me, oh, do you know it's spicy? And I'm like, yeah, yeah, it's okay. I can eat spicy. To be very honest, not that spicy. <laughs> in total it is now 3 p.m which is freaking awesome uh, right now I'm, I'm in an Ola cab and we are off to our oh yeah, home hotel I could have taken the metro from Kashmir again because the metro in Delhi is awesome but I'm just too tired with only five hours of sleep
starting leaving. People waiting in front of the bank to exchange money. Indian currency. Yeah, no. Your girl took a wonderful nap and I feel a little bit better. It is so nice to be back in the crazy streets of Delhi. Look at this prettiness. And people actually in the past warned me about Fahar Ganj, like, no, oh, it's not a good area, yada yada yada. I'm like, what are you talking about? I love it. So nice and crowded and stuff. It's awesome. Oh, so pretty. I'm actually looking for Sharma Daba right now because I saw they have good food on Zamitu. So I need to eat, you know. There we go, Sharma Daba. I like these kind of places, man. No, Mata Paneer. I really like that one last time in Rishikesh. And just plain rice. Let's have this. I also like it that there are a little bit more veggies involved than just paneer. Juicy gravy. See that? Mm. It's really good. Very, very tasty. A little bit too salty, maybe. Let me grab some paneer, of course. Very hot. Really good paneer as well. Mm. I just said it's a bit too salty, but good food, right? Cheers. The last of food adventures in Delhi. Love salty, love salty. This is why I freaking love Delhi, man. Delhi is, is Delhi is crazy on a whole different level. Like <laughs> all the things you could never imagine, it's in Delhi. It's there. Like 10 liters full of boiling milk in the street. We have it in Delhi. Delhi is freaking awesome. Do you see that? That is not a street light. Somebody uh, told me in the comments that today, like in 200 plus years or something, the moon is the closest to the earth or something and uh, I told him like I'm gonna be in Delhi so I don't know if I'm going to be able to see it through the pollution but it's there there we saw the moon very close apparently the moon actually also looks very close I know you can't see it on camera but it looks like it's a street light actually I just took a shower and I'm gonna go to bed the room tour I will give it to you tomorrow because I need some time for this and I want to properly enjoy it with you. So we'll do that first thing tomorrow morning. I'm sorry if this vlog is a little bit short or boring. My day was literally just traveling to Delhi and checking into my hotel, showering and eating and a little bit of work. That's it. Are you trolling me? Did you promise me food when there is no food? This, this makes me really upset. You promised me paneer jalebi. So if you want more adventure, I would suggest for you to subscribe to this channel because tomorrow we're going to explore Delhi and uh, yeah no I'm not gonna ask you to put a thumbs up thank you so much for watching and sticking with me through this vlog and I will see you next time bye